So let's talk about our heart's best friend today. Our heart's best friend. Let's talk about the food. Healthy fats. Yes, you heard me. A lot of people complain of heart-related problems because we neglect most of the healthy fats, like fats found in avocados. You can also find them in most of the nuts where you have calcium and magnesium. And magnesium and calcium are one of your heart's best minerals to help your heart to constrict and to relax. And so if you want a healthy heart, begin to include a few nuts. In moderation, because nuts are quite high in calorie, good number of the nuts. Another of your heart are the red wines. Many of you don't take red wine, red drinks, all the pomegranate drinks, whether you call it hibiscus flower tea, zobo, as we often call it, all the berries, all the red fruits, indulge in them occasionally because red fruits, red wines are one of your heart's best friend. Then omega-3 uh, rich foods like you find in tuna, mackerels, sardines. No, many of you have not, haven't tasted these foods before. But they are a good source of omega-3 fatty acids. An uncommon fat that supports your heart in a mighty way. A lot of you are just consuming fish. Anything you see, you, any fish. But I tell you, all the fishes are not the same. If it's not a fatty fish, if it's not a source of omega-3 fats, then you may just be consuming some amount of protein, but not a healthy food source for your heart. Your heart's best friend, another of your heart's best friend is leafy greens. Don't let a day pass without green vegetables, because they are one of the world's richest source of magnesium, which your heart needs in order to function properly. All the green vegetables of all categories, especially the low calorie vegetables. Now, the older adults should be more mindful or more choosy when they are taking vegetables. As you get older, there are specific vegetables that are particularly low in calorie that favors your kidney, I mean, favors your liver function, favors most of your internal organs. You must focus on them. Celery is one of them. Parsley is, parsley is one of them. And then a host of others. I mean, fruits or vegetables like tomatoes. It's one of those red fruits. It's also healthy for your heart. Fruits that help to clean the arteries. They are your heart's best friends. You need to also remember that foods like Turkey. Older adults should ensure to watch the end. Turkey. Egg is a source of antioxidant. Antioxidant rich foods are particularly good for your heart. I mean, raw fruits. Raw fruits. Yes. Like occasional apples. Especially green apples because it's a source of malic acid. Malic acid is an uncommon acid. When you hear acid, a lot of people think, oh, it's acid. I'm not going there. No, it's one of your heart's best friend. Green apples, all the vitamin C rich foods in moderation. All the fruits such as oranges in moderation. Remember, anti-inflammatory rich drinks, whether you find them in teas, or whatever but you must also remember that water therapy water makes everything better and so you don't have to starve your heart of water because water is the main transporter of the nutrients whether it's proteins whether it's minerals whether it's water it's doing a lot some of you complaining of uh, heartburn i mean some ha minor heart issues could just be resolved by merely I mean, commencing your water therapy. Yes, you heard me. Water therapy 
we resolve a lot of what we call, I mean, minor heart related issues. And don't forget the very cold foods that are not your friends. Warm food. That is to say that let that water be mildly warm. It's one of your heart's friends. Let that food be warm. It supports your heart. Avoid very cold foods. As said in an earlier video. And if you like this message, don't forget to follow me for more tips like this.